a marriage license isn't just a piece of paper, it's a powerful tool that can bind people together for the sake of children. Among married couples, 18% were uncertain about the future of the ongoing marriage. Among cohabiting couples, it was 34% who were uncertain about the future of that relationship. It's a telling figure because if that figure were realised and couples actually did split up, there would be a huge number of children affected, a much larger number from the cohabiting couples than from the married couples. The second question was, um, is this relationship the most or almost the most important relationship you have? And the figures among married people in Ireland was 72% and among cohabiting couples was 56%. So again, there's a disparity here in terms of the importance that people attach to the relationship. But if marriage is the firmer relationship in which to, to bring up children, then surely couples need to know that. At least we should be discussing it and talking up marriage rather than saying it doesn't matter what kind of relationship, every kind of relationship is the same. Because this would seem to suggest that marriage, in terms of stability, is the stronger when compared to cohabiting relationships. One of the concepts that has been spoken about by psychologists and um, sociologists who are studying this is the concept of sliding, not deciding. Those relationships can often become uh, very um, fixed in the sense that people find it difficult to extricate themselves. You're living in the same house, you maybe bought furniture together, um, you're seen as an item together, more so perhaps than couples who don't live together. Um, and, and, and so just leaving the relationship when the going gets tough or when perhaps the people feel that they really need to move on and meet other people becomes very difficult. And so they sort of drift, drift, they come into the relationship, they've slided into the relationship and they drift along and then either, either don't marry um, or eventually do marry. Um, but but the, the, that is the thinking um, certainly in some of the literature that I've been reading in relation to cohabiting relationships.